now we're literally trying to run to catch the shuttle. I can't quite run in these. They're like slipping off my feet. All because of his coffee. Good morning. Just got some ice. Yeah, this picture though. Scurs me. Morning yoga. Morning stretch. Oh, I heard that. It's like my little hair tie. I borrowed it from the girls. In room dining. Oh. Last night we watched um, the Terminator, the new one, and it was really good. And Veggie was so into it, like he was trying to explain to me what was going on, like half the movie, Impossible. because it was really good, but it was quite confusing. Yeah. You have to remember things that happened almost 30 years ago in 1984. I ended up falling asleep like an hour and a half in, but it was really good. Uh, for breakfast, we have oatmeal mm. with banana, raisins, brown sugar. A fresh fruit platter with yogurt and some coffee. That's pretty good. What I'm most excited about are the gardens, which are gardens. What are you excited about today? Um, coffee and tea and crumpets. What? And What's crumpets? Dinner. Crumpets? I don't even know. I just heard it. It's like biscuits? Oh. I don't want one right now. Oh yeah. Okay, so now to find Benji. I think he went looking for coffee. So we're gonna be late to our shuttle to the gardens, and I'm pretty sure Benji's getting like a cold drip or whatever he calls it. And that takes like 15 minutes, and I don't know where this coffee shop is, so I'm just waiting in the main area. This looks pretty good. Oh no, I'm I'm vlogging. I'm recording myself. It looks pretty coarse then. Um, yeah, it's pretty much like the middle of range. Now we're literally trying to run to catch the shuttle. I can't quite run in these. They're like slipping off my feet. All because of his coffee. We barely made it. How's the coffee though? Yep. I haven't really tasted it yet. So I was running so fast at our bag tour. Good thing it didn't spill. Oh. Hi there. Hi, yeah. there you are. Thanks. Feel your. Just went to the restroom and I realized every single public restroom that we went to, or washroom, they like to call washroom here, has been really clean. And even last night at 11 p.m. when we were near the night market, you know, it's a public restroom and it was clean. That's amazing. You don't, it's sad to say, you don't see that often in public areas around Seattle. So, that was pleasant. Eleven years old. My cousins and I thought this was like the most boring thing ever. We didn't really appreciate the beauty of nature or the flowers. You guys, it's, oh my gosh, that is so beautiful. Look at these flowers. Oh, yeah, they're everywhere.
So we've been here for about an hour and I think we're pretty much done. But we're waiting for tea time, which is in another hour. So we don't even know what to there do. There are other places we have not seen yet. The Sunken Garden, so I think. Okay, we're, we're oh, gonna wait, check out Sunken Garden. Right. Wait. <laughs> Holy cow, honey, are you serious? Jeez Louise. <laughs> In 1934, almost a hundred years ago, look at this thing. Wow. wow, that is so cool. I almost just passed this up without even looking at it. Just to give you an idea, I don't know if this is a good example. I'm 10 feet away from that thing. Look how big that is. Oh, look at that. That's pretty crazy. Hey there, beautiful. Finally here. Nothing to eat yet, but I think so. Here in this tea room or this sunroom. It looks like a sunroom. Oh my gosh, look. There's a little orange plant right here. Honey, there, look at this orange plant. I'm trying to mimic Mia. <laughs> On the bottom we have a house-made sausage roll, roasted vegetable quiche, maple glaze smoked ham on a cheese and chive scone. The white bread is curry chicken salad with cashews. Lastly we have the sweets. There's the Battenberg cake, French macaroon, orange poppy seed loaf, Irish cream napoleon, and a chocolate truffle. Sweet. Thank there you. you. Are. Enjoy. This is about 45 minutes in and I am so full. I can't even eat the cake or anything. It just started raining. Perfect timing that we came here several hours ago to really enjoy the flowers. Benji's favorite thing to do, shop around the souvenir stores. I really don't like it. No, he hates it. What do you think about a butchard gardens magnet? If you need a magnet, it makes sense. Sad thing is, we don't really have much magnet <laughs> space in our fridge. It's only on the side. Okay, I oh. bought body soaps. They smell so good. Yeah. Lychee rose. Who would? I've never smelled this soaps. before in my life. And I also got wild blackberry and their gentle vegetable soaps. And the lady said they're triple milled, uh -huh. whatever that means. Uh -huh. So she said that it lasts longer. How many men can relate to this? Having a wife that probably gets a different scent of soap for every week of the year. Okay. No, I probably not every week. Okay, maybe like every two weeks. Okay. Are you kidding me? Honey, Bath and Body Works. Come on. What? I don't even remember the last time I went to Bath right. and Body Works. Anyways, I could live with the exact same soap for the rest of my life. We're gonna see how good your senses are. <laughs> Thank you. Hey, don't look at the color. Berry. Some kind of berry. Yes, okay. wild blackberry. That's what I was But say. you open your eyes and you looked at the color. Yeah. Please don't open your eyes, okay? Thank you so much. This one's very small. Can you yeah. so, so, turn it around? Here, let me turn it this other way. Here you go. <laughs> I don't know what that one is. Is there one note that you smell from that? Rose. <laughs> nope. Good job. Really? Yeah. Oh. Down there. Bringing away that uh, population just keeps getting bigger and bigger here. So uh, maybe we shouldn't be telling them how nice it is here. Winding but, uh, down and editing. How'd you like it? <laughs> oh snap! I missed it! Oh man! Oh my gosh! Hey, do it again, do it again. No, no, you missed oh, it. Oh frick! You missed it. <laughs> I think we're gonna get ready for dinner, which is gonna be a super late dinner. It's already 8.20. Maybe we'll just eat downstairs? Yeah. Cool. There was this cool Indian restaurant that we walked. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I love that. Ever since you did that in Philippines. No, Tokyo. 
No, it started in Philippines. Oh, really? Do you know why it started? Okay, okay, I'll tell you guys why. Three or four years ago, closer to four years ago, we were in Philippines, and a lot of people would stare at Benji because they could tell that he's a foreigner. That's what they call like people from outside. Because he obviously looks mestizo, which means like, you know, just mixed. half mixed, yeah. He would literally get stares, like hardcore stares, and Benji would look and they would still keep staring and it was kind of awkward. So that's when the look came along. Did I do it stare. to people that stared at me? No, I need to find that vlog, but it was, <laughs> we were at a restaurant and I said, honey, maybe you should just stare back. And that's how it all started. But ever since then, like, no matter what, after all these years, it still makes me laugh so much. Like, it really brightens my mood. But, um, I'm gonna try to find the clip. So, here in Philippines, uh, Benji noticed a lot of people staring at him because they know he's a foreigner, so... I said, hey, maybe you should give him a facial expression to acknowledge that you notice them staring. So here's um, one of them. Imagine you're a Filipino and you're staring at Veggie. How about I give him the, um, the uh, Debbie Downer face? <laughs> yeah, you should totally do that next person. <laughs> We've both been craving Indian food, so supposedly this place has Indian tapas. Benji and it's Hi! New styles, camouflage in your backpacks to your fashion. Dude, I wonder if that was by accident or on purpose. <laughs> really cool. Dinner at Bengal Lounge. Recommended by TripAdvisor. I'm taking video. Was that the Instagram eye? Yeah, I'm trying to get <laughs> What'd you get? Uh, bangle? It's the bangle. called the bangle, like yeah. the, their signature the Amaretto drink. cherry on top. Oh, I've never seen a black Amaretto cherry. Guys, I'm having a mint lemonade uh, with rum. This fan, though. It's gotta be for show because that is not something for show. Drink number three. Are you trying to get turned up? Turned down for what? <laughs> <laughs> I'm still working on this one. How's that one? It's different, so I like yeah, it. Yeah, like yeah, yeah. Because this place is known for their cocktails. Yeah. They make their own mixers. And My only worry is that you're mixing a lot of drinks. That's like your third different. What do you mean, so? Like, you could get sick off of that. Mixing drinks? Barrel? Okay. for all the sweet comments mm -hmm. and for all the anniversary wishes. Our yeah. anniversary actually isn't until, I think, Wednesday. The 12th. Yeah, so. But yeah, you guys are blowing up my Instagram with those uh, well wishes. Yeah, so thank you guys. We're gonna call it a night. And we'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Bye, creepy lady. <gasps> You're gonna need these. <laughs> Where are we going? I don't know. Oh, we're going to Canada. <laughs> huh? Are we going to Canada? We're going to go somewhere in that sea plane. Oh. Victoria Island? Yeah. Oh. No, Victoria, not oh, Island. Surprise? Victoria, BC. Yeah, oh, she doesn't Victoria. know. Victoria. Well, yes, yeah, you're going to Victoria Island, which doesn't really exist. <laughs> Isn't that the place where they used to have Madame Tussauds, or they used to have like... Oh, you've been to Victoria, BC before? Yeah. It's really beautiful there. Yeah, we're gonna... They have botanical I've never been there before. I've never been there before. The person I was gonna surprise is gonna guide me. <laughs> the cutest thing, Mama Bird is feeding Baby Bird. Why does this fascinate me? That's pretty awesome. Oh, because they're being filmed.
They're like, no paparazzi, please. <laughs>